Hello dear students, myself M. D. Nadimia. I am chemistry professor in Gosia P. U. N. Degree College, Basokalyan. In this video lecture, I am going to discuss about the preparation of alkyl halide by using alcohol. So, this is the important and easiest method for the preparation of alkyl halide by using alcohol. Whenever the alcohol are reacting with the hydrogen halide or phosphorus halide, they lead to the formation of alkyl halide. So, here in this case, we will deal the particularly alcohols are reacting with hydrogen chloride in the presence of Lewis acid like ZnCl2 that is anhydrous ZnCl2 they lead to the formation of alkyl chloride. Let us see how <coughs> so alcohol generally we represent alcohol as ROH this is alcohol alcohol upon treating with the hydrogen chloride gas. So, here we required a Lewis acid that is the anhydrous anhydrous ZnCl2 so, it will lead to the formation of alkyl halide like RCl plus H2 this is your alkyl halide chloride and this is your alcohol <coughs> this is your alcohol alcohols are reacting with hydrogen chloride in the presence of ZnCl2, it will lead to the formation of alkyl chloride with the water as a byproduct. Similarly, <coughs> if you look at the mechanism of this reaction, mechanism of this reaction, <coughs> okay, we have so alcohol containing the oxygen, and this oxygen is having a lone pair of electron over it, and we are using here is ZnCl2 as a Lewis acids so what is the tendency it will accept the pair of electrons so therefore this is these electrons are donated to ZnCl2 and hence it will lead to the formation of R and we have the O we have H we have positive charge over it we have Zn and we have Cl2 so this Zn will acquire a negative charge because it gains the electron now what oxygen will do oxygen will try to neutralize the positive charge by gaining this electron so hence it will form alkyl carbonium ion plus we have oh zn and cl2 this is v minus 1 in the first step this is happening here now in the next step what happened we are using hydrogen chloride okay plus we have alkyl carbonium ion in the mixture so therefore for this will shift uh, this hole will shift to this one and it deprotonation of this hydrogen chloride takes place and there will be halogenation of this alkyl carbonium ion so hence we can write it as R and we have Cl plus we have hydrogen plus now in the next step what happens we have there that is intermediate that is H O positively charged species ZnCl2 and we have plus proton so this electrons are donated in this species are donated to the this one and hence it will form it will form what you see H and we have bond O bond H we have a lone pair with a positive charge then we have Zn Zn minus and Cl2 so what oxygen will do oxygen will takes the electron hence in this way it will lead to the formation of H2O plus ZnCl2 so hence we can say that ZnCl2 is as acting as a catalyst and ZnCl2 will not take part in the product and water as well as the alkyl halide is formed by using this method so you can see one more time alcohols on reacting with hydrogen chloride in the presence of anhydrous ZnCl2 it will lead to the formation of alkyl chloride and water as a byproduct. If you look at the mechanism alcohol on reacting with ZnCl2 so ZnCl2 is a Lewis acid it will gain the electron pair of electron and it will acquire a negative charge and this will form a oxygen will form a positive charge over it and it will try to reduce the positive charge by gaining this electron and it will form the alkyl carbonium ion and this is kind of intermediate now we have HCl and alkyl carbonium ion so this Cl minus will attack on the what we can say the alkyl carbonium ion to lead to the formation of alkyl chloride and proton so this proton is attacking the, the, the electrons are donated to this proton from this species and it will form again a positively charged 
positive charge over oxygen and oxygen will neutralize the positive charge by gaining this electron and water and ZnCl2 all not for the tertiary alcohol simply by shaking the hydrogen chloride with tertiary alcohol it will lead to the formation of alkyl chloride this is because there will be a more steric hindrance there will be a more uh, what we can say that branches on the alcohol and the bond is easily broken between the carbon and OH therefore it will lead to the formation of hydrogen uh, uh, sorry alkyl chloride and there is no requirement of ZnCl2